Yeah. You share so, clothes, don't you? You both yeah. the same size. She, she rates my wardrobe sometimes, don't you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you ever rate hers? <laughs> no. <laughs> her stuff is too cool for me, I think. But yeah, I'm she doesn't want to wear my clothes for some reason. I don't understand <laughs> what? why. No, no, you're too young, Phoenix. <laughs> so so how... what is this about dressing my age? Or Not more your age, but just, like, the way... <laughs> A mum mom would look. <laughs> a mum, in, in our case, I guess, would dress if you take the kids to school every day and, you know, watch Maddie and Angel play soccer or whatever. I think I Less look. provocative, oh, is that oh, yeah, what you're less, saying? less scary. Less scary. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Do you know what I wondered? What, what age were you when you realised that your mum was one of the Spice Girls? Um, I don't know. I, I mean, I kind of was just brought up in it like, right from the start. So I guess when I... It was just me and my mum for a very long time, so... Seven years. Yeah, eight years, so... I don't know. And then how did you feel when the siblings came along? I was really excited. I hated being the only kid. <laughs> oh, did I was you? alone. I, didn't mean, I mean, it was me and you, but then when you would work and stuff, I would, what, sit and play with my thumbs? Like, <laughs> in fact, you know? Do, do, do you remember you actually helped me give birth to, to Madison? Yeah, don't forget that. Did she? <laughs> she was 13 years old. Yeah. That's amazing. It was... Beautiful, in a way. Yes. Uh, no. Well, I did <laughs> check that you wanted to do that. And, and, then, the and then you named her. Yeah, I did. That, that was beautiful. That I take to my heart to the day I die. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm. it was really nice. And what about the accents? Do you understand all what your mum says? <laughs> I do, but I sometimes try to <laughs> block it out because it's too much. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> As a point of interest now, do you like the Spice Girls music? I mean, did you like it? I like it. it. I yeah. think it's really cool and really hip. I mean, you've obviously got a very close oh, relationship, yeah. actually, and as much as it's mother and daughter, you're very good mates. Yeah. But there's lots of things you don't get the chance to say to your mum or your daughter, and the two of you have taken a few moments out to write what you really want to say to one another. Mm -hmm. um, is, that, is that your card there, Phoenix? This I'll, I'll let card. you start, OK? Oh, I'm starting. Yeah, you can start. OK, should I read out Yeah, the... go for it. It says, Mum, I'm so proud of you for... Being a boss. Oh, hey. I like that. Yeah. I like that. OK, I'll read you mine. Phoenix, I'm so proud of you for being just you. You know why? Uh, because you're 19 years old and you've turned into a, a very humble, respectful woman, lady, actually. And, and I see you with, with your friends and you support other women. And they always, they always come to you for advice and help. I, I, think, I think that's beautiful. Thank you. Oh. Please do that. Yeah. That's good. Happy with that. I get. So you just did one word. You got a whole sentence from me. <laughs> okay, but my sentence means a, my word means a lot. Yeah. All right. Okay. <laughs> Go on. You know. Your turn. Uh, the on. thing I love most about you is. You, you think you're a kid. You think you're eight, nineteen. No, I do. I do. In my so it's easier to bond with you as a mum. <laughs> you know, because you think you're like me. So. <laughs> A 19, you think that I think that I'm a 19 year old, not like a five or a six year old, right? I mean, some days you're two, three, four. <laughs> five. Moving on. The thing I love most about you is you're very wise. You'd say it's, like, it's like you know things, and I really love that about so you. My answers are so different from me. I know. Yeah. <laughs> Go on, next one. Um, I like this game. The thing people might not know about you oh, is. Oh dear. You. This is really hard. I don't. This is really difficult. Oh, Why? Just say it out there. Just say just it. Go on. You just. People think that. Go on. <laughs> I don't know. It's only an half hour left. Yeah. Come on. <laughs> you, you don't have an answer for that? I, I, can, I really couldn't answer that one. Okay, well, I'll answer it. You're so yeah. open. You're just so out there with everything. I don't really know what. There's not much. Is it my Reiki? Yeah. Yeah. Is it my Reiki on my angel cards? That... <laughs> no. <laughs> no. no. I don't answer that Because I do one. Reiki on my kids too, and they go, get off. Yeah. Okay, the thing people might not know about you is you're very, very sensitive, and you actually look after oh. me mm. more than I look after you sometimes. I probably would have said that too. Yeah. Well, I said it first. <laughs> go, go, go. I would have said that too. Um, you're funniest when we travel together. Whenever Why? we travel together, because it's always just me and you. It's like mum and foe just doing shenanigans all the time. As in, you laugh at me. We like whenever we're in the airport together, we always just I don't know, we're always just funny. I think I think we we're are on the plane, we're funny, good. you know. I find I like it. I find you you funniest when you, when you first wake up in the morning because you're I hate so mornings. moody and you don't know where anything is. <laughs> you're just all discombobulated. Especially today because you had a night out last night. I know we had a late <laughs> yeah. night. I was last so night. grumpy this morning. <laughs> <laughs> you are. Really grumpy. Um, What's your next question? When you're not there, the thing I miss the most is your presence. 
Oh, that's lovely. Oh, that's that.